Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Baz from Stoic Gaming with another episode of First Time Playing. And today we're going to be playing Shadows of Mordor. This game just came out. I just got it installed. And we are going to our planet. Um, I've never actually seen hardly any footage of this game. I haven't seen hardly anything about this game yet. So as I was saying, I haven't seen a lot of this game. I've listened to some stuff on podcast about it. I'm kind of familiar with what the Nemesis system is. I haven't seen hardly any of it in action. So I'm completely fresh. I have no idea what to expect. I'm going to try and do all this in one cut without without changing anything. Hopefully finish this game in a series. So uh, everything's set to ultra right now. I'm running a GTX 780 and uh, with a 4770K overclocked to 4.3 gigahertz, I believe, right now with 16 gigs of uh, 1866 RAM. So we're going to go ahead and boot into the game. I've already set all my graphics. I put them on ultra. We're going to see how that works out, and uh, here we go. First time playing, Shadows of Mordor. Uh, change skins. You know what? We're going to jump right into story mode. We are going to listen to the story and pay attention to that, so if you're interested in that kind of thing, that's what that's what we're going to see. In the land of Mordor, where the shadows lie. It was here. On the slopes of Mount Doom. God, I love Lord of the Rings. The Dark Lord Sauron was defeated by a last alliance of men and elves. We've been waiting a long time for a solid, good Lord of the Rings game. It is here that two and a half thousand years the rangers of Gondor stood watch, guarding against a nameless threat that had been forgotten. And while the strength of Gondor faded, the power and malice of Sauron grew in darkness. He has returned to Mordor. Shadow and flame have fallen on the Black Gate. And no mortal man can stand in its path. The graphics are pretty amazing. You're a I am playing with an Xbox 360 controller. And the game's kind of a console game too. I figure that's probably the best method to play as opposed to playing with my keyboard and mouse. Maybe switch it up if it seems like it's more keyboard and mouse friendly. Is a perfect swing for killing chicken. Wouldn't want to hurt you. I'll take a lot more than that. <laughs> Dear Hyle, the mighty chicken killer. Come on. Come on. Show your father what you have, huh? You'll have to hit harder if you want to best your father. Hard enough? All right, so we're learning how to parry Terry, attacks so right now. Don't yep. forget to block. Perhaps you should not be to hit. Stay alert, dear Hyle. Your enemy will not always be as he appears. Easy, sir. You're not a soldier yet. I'll have your guts! Oh, wow. Stand fast, 
there. You control the camera. Pretty standard controls. Grab and throw. Pretty good. Get to slice up some orcs as soon as we start the game. These orcs are much stronger than any we've ever seen. They're not orcs, they're orcs. Or orcs, whatever. Yes, yeah, they're orcs too. Go find your mother. Go find your mother. Keep her safe. I'll be right behind you. Go. Storytelling's got almost a Witcher kind of vibe to it. Pretty slick. Am I dead? You are banished from death. For stealth, but on the road, let's not forget the love. <laughs> Happy anniversary, my love. Alien, this is beautiful. Where did you find it? I still have a few friends left in Gondor. Did you talk to my father? Yes, I did, and nothing has changed. He's still very stubborn. I say we go anyway. Dear High will not come willingly. There must be a better life than this. Not now. But soon. I'm just so tired of hiding here, Italian. <laughs> we must hide now, or we are both dead. Stealth is my only advantage. See if the wife's doing all right back there. No, obviously we're not going there yet. Got to be more herds to kill here up somewhere. Pretty comfortable the way this. Oh, there we go. The way this guy moves around. Oh, you're gonna get it. The sword down, Ranger. This isn't good. Not at all. No. Ow. The Black Hand wants him alive. Take her. Yes. 
Oh, there it goes, yeah. Killed my boy. See for yourself. Then I run. Oh, my ranger. What has happened to me? You are banished from death. Cast adrift between the worlds of light and dark. A curse binds us together within the walls of Arda. If what you say is true, then how do we break this curse? We find the one who cast it on us. The Black Hand of Sauron. Oh shit. Unlocking Forge Towers unlocks the Wraith's memory. This unlocks new missions, collectible locations on the maps, and Miriam. Press B. <clears throat> I'm starting to get a kind of uh, Assassin's Creed vibe. Hold A to move. Let's move forward to jump off the ledge. <laughs> so, we missed one of you at Narcos, eh? An easy mistake to fix. I got a bow. Some kind of spirit bow. Hold LT to enter range. Hold RT to charge your shot. You will suffer for what you've done! The Black Hand wanted them all dead! Oh, wow, okay. Whoa. I'm walking the wall here, it's kind of buggy. Special powers, that's pretty cool. What's this ghost dude? He didn't really explain who he was. RP to grab, A to interrogate. 
What do you know of the Black Hand of Sauron? He is a fiend. Made of thin air. What more? A slave I had. Swears he fought him. I sold him for a cake of grog. These are the captains of Sauron's armies. They appear as shadows because you don't know their identity. Press A to continue. By interrogating enemies, you uncover valuable information about these captains. Press A to learn the identity of this captain. <coughs> Gamud the Slayer. If you have learned Gamud's identity, this will help you hunt him down. His title, the Slaver, or Slaver, not Slayer, gives you clues about his role in the Uruk society. Well, slaves. You have also learned his power rating. This gives you an indication of how difficult he will be to defeat. The power rating also determines your rewards for defeating him. Rewards include runes to upgrade your weapons and increasing your own power to unlock new ability tiers. The map and objectives show you where this captain can be located. Press A to mark your target. Alright. where we have to go. Okay, let's do it. If one can trust an orc. Trust has nothing to do with it. His thoughts cannot lie. Alrighty, Gamuv is gonna die. Gold icons advance the story. Red icons display power struggles where Uruks compete for status. Uh, Ward power to unlock the mobility tiers. White icons represent side missions and collectibles. Mirian to upgrade. Two available main missions: the Slaver, save the humans trapped within Mordor, and find the Black Captains. For the Spirit of Mordor, learn more about Uruk society and take down Sauron's army from within. And tell me that this game has changed. Nothing makes sense. All Nothing open world? Changed. Are you serious? This is, this is how awesome. Be. The future and the past are linked in darkness. I don't understand why I'm here. And I uh, can't remember. What is this? Let's go find the slaver. His mind may provide answers. Alright. I can flip through all these guys, but we only got one guy. I can flip them all. Who's this guy? Ratbag the Coward, Power 4, located at main mission. Feeling like he deserves much more respect. Oh. Doing it. Blade tries to escape soon, wanting to make an example of the mission. Weapons and runes, so I got a sword. Runes are available. Orc Slayer. Combat finishers do extra damage against cat. Sure. Oh, I don't have any rooms. Dagger. Uh, brutalize. Stealth kills cause additional terror. Sure. Uh, earn experience to gain ability points and unlock powerful new abilities. Play power struggles to earn power more quickly and unlock ability tiers. Holy crap, this game is pretty deep. Everything is still locked up. End disease. Italian. This is going to be stuff we can learn about the backstory and all that.
fast travel back there. Whoa. That's pretty large. This is this is that rat bag. We're gonna go to the slaver. We're gonna do what they want us to do. that can shoot fire. They're the best trained. Oh, this motherfucker. <laughs> These slaves have to stay. Whipped his dagger out there, that's pretty much. awesome. Any good that we deserve to be hanging off the end of my sword. Yeah, that's a little better, isn't it? I can see the mini map, see what's going on. Total awareness. The icon above Eric's head displays his awareness. Yellow indicates that Eric is investigating a disturbance. Red indicates that Eric is aware of you. Press RT to sneak reduce. Ranger! Ranger! Black the sting of a fast toxin or the long burn of a slow poison. I'm gonna have to kill this thing, I think. Yeah, I pressed right on the D-pad because I thought I had an ability point that I needed to spend. When your hit streak is charged, press Y and B to execute your target. Pretty cool. Counter enemies will be knocked backwards, stunned, or knocked out. Pretty dead. Target's lethal. You'd fire barrels to come. Yes. That's the end of Lap Bag the Poisoner. See you later. I love the little like, cockney accents they've got.
flesh. Grind your bones. Are you going to die? Change struggle. Uh, use L to move the cursor in a circle, then press the display counter button to attack. Press the display counter button. Oh. So he killed me, so his power increases. Oh, the evil eyes survive, power increases. Jesus. We're still going after this guy. Holy shit, power's nine. Still going after the slaver, dude. What are these towers of silver? They are lights to guide us in the land the of shadow, this guy? where all other lights may fail. Pale reflections of the light of the two trees and memories of a lost kingdom. Automatically enter stealth and tall bushes. So we gotta go. There's like bad guys everywhere. Like, look at them all. Is that the group that I was just fighting? Guys, I'm gonna see if I can. Transform back and forth into that other guy is kind of weird. I haven't quite figured that out yet. Shit.
seem to be holding down the right trigger a lot in this game. collectibles like floating around. Ooh. Stick with those guys. Let's see if we can just get to this dude. I made it to the point. Orc slaver holds a captive with information on the black captains. Hunt down the slaver, rescue the captive, and find out what he knows. Okay. Well, this doesn't bode well. Don't you see? The prisoner created a distraction. to track the Uruk. I see more than any mortal. I'm no Crobane is worthy of me. Use Wraith World to identify targets. Press R to identify slave captain. Slay the orc captain. Cut off the head of the snake and the body will wither. Archers. I must take out the eyes of the camp. Shut your face! I ain't giving you the satisfaction! If you killed him, how come he killed a bunch of us just yesterday? Cause he's a ghost. You kill him and he just comes back. You'll see. He'll be back for us all. from noon here a few days ago. Jesus, it's insane, right? The ground broke loose and now someone's gotta go get it back. Pretty I have to kill. Oh, this is gonna end badly. That was an accident. Strong slave. That one hits me. I don't understand. Alright, I'm doing something wrong with that survive thing. Why use your human side to track the Uruk? I see more than any mortal. 
Take that worm! So yeah. the orc captain. Cut off the head of the snake, and the body will wither. Archers. I must take out the eyes of the camp. That's the wind, I suppose. If it comes back, we'll kill it then. Must have been only go. Now we're gonna go up here and see if we can kill this guy up top. Stay on guard. I heard the slave begging for mercy, begging you for his life. <laughs> One more run, we'll be out of pole. of the mines need to work their soft skins harder. Yeah, the quartermaster don't like the way where it's the dust for half the day. Well, we're getting some of those back. If he fought with cold from under use, he'd throw him right, slide masters in it for fuel. <laughs> I'd like to see him do that to one. It'd be like a real fire under the rest. Thought you were fast enough to escape, eh? No weakling man can outrun an Udo. See those slaves? They tried to get away, but now they will die tied to a pole. The same fate awaits you. Do not try to run again. Be harder without speed. Where's this last archer? I smell meat. Slave meat. About time. All I've had all week is watered down catagol feed. I see. Sneaking about. He's dead! Wait! 
right. Alright, we got another ability now. What do we got? Countered enemies. Yeah, that's a definite. Especially if we're going to be fighting this many guys at one time. This is, this is definitely important. Alright, so. Oh, you rancid little wretches. Don't you look at me. Clanging we've been hearing coming from the forge means only one thing. Did you hear that? Captain says a patrol picked up some new trucks. All right, that guy's down. I think I cleared out enough of these guys. Hey, did you hear? The resistance threw the slave and they let him over. Man swine! A pity I have to kill you. Here we go. Make a strong slave. What did I pick up? Bell voice is epic. Recover all focus and all health for killing a captain or war chief. Uh, you can slot runes into your weapons. Select your weapons with left and right. Press A to view your rune. Equip rooms to available rune slots with A. You can upgrade your weapons with additional rune slots by spending M. Mirian or Mirion, whatever the hell that shit was called. I say to continue. Cover all focus and health for killing a captain. Sure. Rune level. The power of a captain determines the level of the rune he drops. Killing a captain using his vulnerability will gain, will guarantee the type of rune you drop. Stealth equals dagger, ranged equals bow, combat equals sword. Press A to continue. Hug Evil Eye is your current nemesis. This guy. Because that guy killed me before, I think. That's the first little mission done. That's good stuff. That's pretty sick. Wow. I gotta say, if this game keeps up at, at this level, this game is a 10 out of 10. This is amazing. I take it you did not come here to arrest me for treason, Captain. You and I are all that remains of that garrison, Hugo. And why did you come here? I'm looking for a slave that fought the Black Hand of Sauron. <laughs> More like ran away from him. You know this man. Of course. You're staring at him. Where are the servants of the Dark Lord? Do you even know? 
Perhaps. This is no time to keep secrets. I have been stuck here for weeks. Steady. Come to the outcast camp. We shall ask my scouts. I'll be there. And this is never less. Are you kidding me? Gollum. What's up, dude? Schmeagol. Schmeagol. Just another orc. No. no. Someone wants to be seen. We should tread with caution. Slaver success. Mission complete. 600 experience. Bonus subjective plus 50. Behold the runes. Elvish smiths and detail their great deeds and commemorate the triumphs of the long dead warriors with these enigmatic and powerful markings. The smiths employ arcane craft to create their runes, recording the final fate of their enemies with the metallic compound they filled in and attaching them to their armor blades and great bows. In this way, the elves create and cast a unique legend for their fabled weapons. This legend will grow with each great deed. The Uryx will come to know weapons adorned by them in name, as they will have Glamdring and Ochrist. Here, their power. Great. Interested party is now available. That's all we need. All maggots stealing our grog. Fine. As long as they're tough enough to fight, I don't care. Oh. Alright, how do I save this weapon? Or save this game, excuse me. I don't know. So that's him. That's my nemesis right now. Pug Evil Eye. So that's the end of the first episode, guys. We will pick back up here uh, next time I play. Uh, hopefully this game saves. If not, we'll probably start over and I'll get to roughly the same point. Might have a different nemesis, but yeah, this is pretty sick. So far, if this game keeps this up, 10 out of 10. Uh, stay tuned. In the next days coming, I will definitely be doing more episodes of this. And there will be more Arc Age. Uh, Perdition just posted a new Arc Age video where he's farming bots, which is pretty funny. Kind of sad if you think about it, but uh, that's it for this. As always, I'm Baz from Stoic Gaming, and I will see you when I see you. Take it easy. Bye.